Good morning, everyone. We do have some reduced visibility, some low ceiling, and dealing with showers as well. So visibility certainly could be an issue out across Chicagoland over the course of this morning and uh, leading into the next couple of hours. And we look outside right now, and it's just not the prettiest picture, sadly. And that'll be the case, unfortunately, pretty much all day today, looking at that low ceiling, certainly out across our area. O'Hare right now coming in at 56 degrees, midway at about 56. I've got 59 degrees for Gary. Waukegan coming in at around 52. Feels like 52 though because winds are fairly light. Visibility in Waukegan is right at about two miles. Here's a look at that rain across Chicagoland. No matter where you're going, you're going to find rain out there today. It's pretty steady and consistent and across the vast majority of Chicagoland right now. Not particularly heavy in any location, though we did have a few areas of lightning detected out around DeKalb earlier this morning. That's kind of tapered to a close now. Satellite and radar tracker is going to show maybe a bit of a break for some of you across the southern suburbs, uh, even from the city down into northwest Indiana at around lunchtime today. But that shower activity rotates back in through the afternoon and evening. And unfortunately, we'll see a good amount of shower activity as well through most of your Thursday. High temperatures today will be from 51 degrees in Waukegan up to about 55 degrees for Joliet and Kankakee and 57 degrees around Rensselaer. Seven day planner has us with mid fifties both today and tomorrow. There may be a little bit of sunshine <clears throat> right before the sun sets on your Thursday, but today is a very dreary kind of nap indoors day for sure. Friday looks significantly better in the mid 60s with sunshine and I love Saturday. That's the best day of the week at 75 degrees and partly cloudy. Sunday we will have a few scattered showers back in the mix with a temperature of around 65 degrees leading into next week a little bit cooler than average as well unfortunately but average this time of the year is 64 so even just a little bit below average it's not terrible.